and thank you, Ambassador, for your very kind introduction. And thank you for the invitation to be here tonight in this beautiful venue at the Andrew Mellon Auditorium at the Department of Commerce. And to you, sir, to members of the Diplomatic Corps, to members of Congress, distinguished guests, friends and colleagues, it's my pleasure to join you all this evening to celebrate the 26th anniversary of Azerbaijan's Republic Day. Tebrik Edarim. Congratulations to you all. I would like to thank the Ambassador and the Embassy of Azerbaijan for this invitation. The Ambassador has done incredible work here in Washington. This is not an easy town to work in, and we are a government of a thousand doors, and you have to knock on every one of them, and you have to do so persistently, and the Ambassador has done so, his Embassy has done so, and sir, I would like to congratulate you. Twenty-six years ago, Azerbaijan became an independent country for the second time. In little more than a quarter century, the world has seen Azerbaijan emerge as a strong and independent nation, linking the long, rich history of its people with a bright future. President Trump, in his congratulatory letter to President Aliyev, wrote, on behalf of the American people, I want to congratulate you and the people of Azerbaijan as you celebrate Republic Day. Azerbaijan is a valued partner of the United States. Together, we are working to enhance global security through our joint counterterrorism efforts. We stand with the people of Azerbaijan and are committed to strengthening our relationship through dialogue on security, economic cooperation, and democratic principles. We are, you are building new sources of energy for Europe, and we are grateful for our long and successful history of cooperation in this area. As you move to diversify your economy, we look forward to building new business ties to the benefit of both of our countries. The United States also strongly supports the peaceful resolution of the nagorno karabakh conflict. I congratulate you again on this important day and look forward to working with you as an active partner to ensure a greater future for our countries and the world. Sincerely, Donald J. Trump, President of the United States. As we celebrate Azerbaijan's independence, we also mark, as the Ambassador noted, 25 years of diplomatic relations between our countries. I want to underscore the strong partnership that the United States and Azerbaijan have built together through years of cooperation on energy and security issues, as well as dialogue on democratic principles. Looking at the broad scope of the U.S.-Azerbaijan relationship, I'm pleased to say that Azerbaijan has remained a steadfast partner to the United States on many fronts. Today, we are together diversifying Azerbaijan's energy export markets, bringing new security to its growing economy, while also substantially increasing Europe and the world's energy security by expanding and diversifying its sources of oil and gas supplies. Our collaboration on the Baku, Tbilisi, Sehan oil pipeline, which came online in 2006, was a defining moment in our partnership. Now, we're working closely on the $40 billion Southern Gas Corridor, scheduled to come online in 2018 for gas deliveries to Turkey, and in 2020 and 2021 for gas deliveries to Italy. As President Trump said in his letter last month to President Aliyev in celebration of the 24th Annual International Caspian Oil and Gas Exhibition and Conference in Baku, and I quote, I appreciate Azerbaijan's important role in bolstering ener global energy security, including the development and exportation of energy resources from the Caspian region. Americans hope for increased stability and prosperity in Azerbaijan and believe that the conference and the Southern Gas Corridor are important to achieving those goals." End quote. Our business and commercial ties also continue to evolve as Azerbaijan develops and diversifies its economy. We are working together to foster open, competitive markets that will result in growth and prosperity for Americans and Azerbaijanis alike. Azerbaijan remains a committed security partner to the United States. It was one of the first countries to come to our aid after the attacks of 9-11. 
Azerbaijan has also contributed to peacekeeping operations in the Balkans and Iraq, and today contributes soldiers and logistical support to NATO's resolute support mission in Afghanistan. We are deeply appreciative of our joint efforts in the fight against terrorism. In addition to our cooperation on energy and security issues, we value our dialogue on democratic principles and encourage Azerbaijan's efforts to reflect its constitutional founding to build a more secure and prosperous nation that respects the fundamental rights of all its peoples. Once again, on behalf of the President of the United States, on behalf of the Secretary of State and the U.S. government and the American people, I congratulate all Azerbaijanis on this special day for their remarkable achievements and incredible history. I am grateful for your country's close partnership with the United States and look forward to many more. Thank you very much and congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.